this project I started with an 8x8 canvas that I had painted white and then took Artist Loft iridescent medium and put a second coat. It is so sparkly and pretty when you paint it with that. Then I took a concoction of Unicone Art 24 karat gold mica powder and Artist Gloss varnish and I mixed them together in a little plastic cup. And what I did was I painted a border of this along the sides and about a quarter inch in on the top of the canvas. And um, this is really easy to use. I don't know. I guess you could use a metallic marker, but I already had this paint on the glass heart that I had painted, so I wanted the golds to match. And this is just a beautiful metallic gold, and um, it's really not that difficult to do. So once I had the border painted on, I let that dry, and then I used my three heart molds. And these heart molds I know I've used in previous projects, and um, I've shown you what I've done with the small and the large, and now this is what I'm doing with the medium one. So you can get these on Amazon for $11.99, and I have them linked in the description. I uh, pre-mixed my resin. It's art resin, a one-to-one -one ratio resin that has to be mixed slowly for three minutes to help prevent bubbles. And I just put a thin layer at the bottom of each of the hearts and then put the glass on top so that each of the pieces of glass was touching resin so that it would be held together. Then after I had the bottom layer on, I went ahead and used up the rest of the glass and made a second layer on all three of the hearts. And then I took resin and I just drizzled it over the second layer so that I was sure that each piece of glass was at least touched by the resin so that it would, once it dried or cured, it would be held down. Now this has to sit on a flat level surface overnight. After about 12 hours, you can demold it. It is still pliable at that time. Um, you can bend it, but after a full 72 hours, it'll be rock solid and it is fully cured. So this has to um, cure at temperatures between 72 and 85 degrees Fahrenheit. Now all resins are different. You need to read the directions for the resin that you are using. So when you take it out of the mold, you have to be really careful. You have to slowly remove it. Um, go all the way around the edges to make sure that nothing's stuck because when you use a heat element to get rid of the bubbles, sometimes you can melt the, mold, the actual mold to the glass or to the resin and the mold can tear. So you have to be really careful with it. And um, this is what it looks like before I put the gold border on it. It's so pretty. Next, I use the same technique with the Unicone 24 karat gold and the Artist Gloss Varnish. Mix them together in a cup and then use that to paint the sides of the heart along with the about a quarter inch border around the heart. And in this, I'm doing actually doing the largest heart, but um, I guess I didn't film doing the medium size heart. But it, it was both of them were done the same way. And this is so pretty. Um, the difference between using this and using the metallic marker is that with this paint, you can get in all the nooks and crannies. It's a lot easier to do. And it's this is just a beautiful gold. It really is pretty. Um, so anyway, when I was done with that, I had to let that dry for an hour or so, and then it was ready for the resin. So I don't know how well you can see me putting on the resin, but um, I took, uh, pre-mixed the resin. It's art resin that I'm using, and oh, you can see it had some problems with the canvas, the paint coming up, but I believe the heart hides all that when I put it back on. I think I had set the heart down on it when it was still a little damp and then pulled it back up and it brought some of the paint off. But anyway, all I did was I um, took, took the resin and I just spread it out all over the canvas. And then when I set it down, I set it down on top of um, a couple of cups because you don't want it to stick to the protective paper below. Yeah, you can see the other part um, where I ripped the uh, the paint, the top layer of paint off, but the heart does hide that. So because it was the heart that was sitting on it that pulled the paint off. So after I was done putting all the resin on, um, I just simply placed the heart on top of it. And this has to sit on a flat level surface overnight. After 12 hours, you can um, 
you can touch it. It takes a full 72 hours to cure at temperatures between 72 and 85 degrees Fahrenheit. Hey everyone, just a quick uh, video to show you what I did with the medium size heart that I made. Now at first I wasn't even going to put it on anything. I actually had it just sitting on this little um, stand uh, on the table over there and it looked really pretty like that too. So that's another idea. I should have took a picture of it for you. But um, I think this is real pretty with the gold around it. And again, um, so the gold that I put around here, I also put around here so that they would match. Otherwise it's easier probably to do it with the metallic marker, but because I used that uh, gold on this, I thought it would uh, match. But anyway, I think that turned out real pretty like this. I kind of messed up some of the paint right here, but whatever. Um, anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. If that helps the channel. If you want to be notified of future videos, go ahead and subscribe. And I hope you guys all have a great day. Thanks for watching.